This is part 61 of our Minish Cap walkthrough, and a very rarity for any Zelda game. There's actually stuff that we can do in this game only after we beat the final boss, and we're going to do that in this uh, part right here. And you thought you were done with yeah, this. Yeah, 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 you're not done. <laughs> well, we said at the end of the last one you weren't done, but in yep. this one, there's like six figurines that we can now collect that will get us the Karloff medal, and then we can also get the Mirror Shield, which... I don't understand why they give you the mirror There's shield. There's no point. The, like, the figurines make sense because you actually did see a couple characters until Agreed. now. Agreed. But, like, the mirror shield, like, why do you need it after you beat the game? It's the only thing I can think of is the fact that, you know, after we saved at the end of the previous part and we restarted the game, which you saw us do at the beginning of this video, it's like you still can beat Vati again if you want yeah, to. Yeah, I think you reflect all those, like, shots. Can you reflect those shots? I would I assume. Actually, I actually have no clue what the mirror I, shield I, does, but I would think, I know it reflects something, but I don't know, like, light, but I don't know what would clarify as, like, light. Is it the shock attacks? Is it not the I'm shock not sure. attacks? The only description that we get is it says it deflects enemy attacks. Uh -huh. What attacks? We Every attack. Know. That's what would be good about it, but just getting this item, like, I just... Red and I are both not fans of this. Like, no, well, we didn't even do it. Let's you be know, honest. Once it's we, stupid. Yeah, once we beat the game the first time, we were done with it. But Sorry, not to beat around the bush, but it's kind of dumb. It is. It's just. <laughs> it's the only Zelda game I can really remember. Like, where you could, you like, you couldn't do this until after you beat the game. Exactly. Like, now there's some stuff that, like, you know, you just don't do until after you beat the game. But this wasn't even possible till now. And that's the thing. It's like there's some open world games that like you can continue messing around in yeah, the world uh -huh, after uh -huh. you beat the final boss. Uh -huh. The Zelda games have never been that way. No, they're not. Uh -huh. But well they've been that way. You can do stuff still. But, yeah. but you like everything's always available before exactly. then. Exactly. So. This part's stupid. We hate it, but you know what? <laughs> We're it's doing a, it. It's a 99.9% .9 walkthrough. Yeah. So we got to do it. The only thing I did kind of think No, was, screw it. it's 100. It, if you want the stupid tingle trophy, go be on your own. <laughs> then you have problems with <laughs> I, I, I won't say that because there's some people who want to get everything. That's true. That's so true. That I, I will true. not judge you for that. that I am not true. one of those people. Yeah. I don't think Kick is either. No, <laughs> but like we said, like, um, I mean, excuse me. I don't know if I would have gotten the Tingle Trophy. Like, no. you gotta do all 100 fusions, as we said, to get the Tingle Trophy. Yep. Well, honestly, when I was playing through the game, I had no idea that it was an item you can even get, so no. that's why I didn't do it. But at the same time, 100 fusions is so much. And it like, is. You gotta have so many certain kinstones. I don't know if I would have ever done it. Now, I will say, though, that uh, at least in this, uh, whatever you call it, post ending yeah, post part, part uh -huh. we got to go back to the sky. Yes, that's which true, is cool. which is awesome. Only for a few seconds, but yeah. it was still pretty awesome. And we get to spend a little more time here on Vale Falls. Now, that's true. Now, is this the big same big Goron that we see in Ocarina of Time? Because you gotta remember, Minish Cap came before Ocarina of Time, so is this the same. Because uh, how many big Gorons? Maybe. How many big Gorons have you seen? In Zelda games, it, there's this one, the, the sumo one, one the sumo one, and Twilight sumo Princess. one doesn't count. <laughs> That's kind of a joke. Well, <laughs> I guess you didn't find that. Oh, I thought you were about to say he doesn't no, count. I'm it, sorry. It, we've it. done six one part. Well, <laughs> not one night, but oh god, we'd be I thought it was a good joke, we, but we'd, we'd be hammered. What am I oh saying? Oh my god, we would. Yes. <laughs> I was thinking of the uh, the big one on the mountain from Majora's Mask. Is also the one that blows the cold air that freezes you. But oh, okay, yeah, I totally forgot about that one. But Termin is a whole alternative. Yeah, parallels, whatever. So, yeah, it's a lot. Do you want to go? But with you that. know, good point. It could be how Majora's Mask works. <laughs> it could be the same one. I will say it was neat though that we saw like just the tip of his head earlier in this game. Mm -hmm, we got mm -hmm. up here, and now we get to see him in full. <sighs> But but you see it too late. I'm you see it too late in the game. It would've been cooler like if you would saw him earlier in the game. Yeah. And you've been wondering more throughout the game, like what is this thing? What's exactly. this thing right here that we keep on seeing? Like I'm you saw him too that. late to be like curious about yeah. it for very long in the game. And if you didn't know to be honest, if you didn't know it was a big Goron, you may have just thought it was a mountain behind it. Because I, all it is, is the well, his head's head. yeah, his head's very similar to Goron though. True, and it like moves a little, but uh -huh. if you're not paying any attention though. Yeah. Now right here, all we're doing is I'm just a little bit short on shells. I just want to, <laughs> you know, get 100 probability every single time. Yeah. So I just came in here to buy some shells. Um, it's probably a part that I could have taken out, but I just didn't yeah. think it was going to take that long. And I kind of just wanted to, I, you know. I honestly don't know why I didn't put this part out, <laughs> but we're buying shells right here. I will say it's one of the very few times in this game where having like the full 900 and whatever rupees actually uh -huh. comes in handy because it's like 200 bucks for 30 or something. Well, I mean, we said been sitting here not collecting shells for like the longest time because yeah. we're maxed out, and then I get to the end, I'm like, well, we need, need like 600 shells. Yeah. You know, to get the last 100% chance. So, yeah, the 100% chance. So, and also, I wanted to, sh uh, to show the uh, shop again to everybody. Yeah. Like, you know, the nice little shop and everything. We bought some great things in here. 
we bought we a had. boomerang. We bought the quiver and ball uh, no. bag. Uh, ooh, do we get both? Oh, we did get yeah. both of those. Yeah, so yeah. this has been a very good shop in this game, actually. It's now, been one of the only places we started. 30 shells is way too much, so 200 uh, rupees for 30 oh. shells. It's a ripoff. No, it's definitely a ripoff. <laughs> but the Kinstone Fusions from the uh, Goron were a ripoff too yep. in this game. Speaking of the uh, of the Gorons, though, the big Goron, this is kind of an important point to bring up. You saw that he, uh, he decided to take a taste of our shield. Uh huh. And he's going to chew on that for a long, yeah. long, and long I, time. And I don't, yeah, you want to say long a couple more times? <laughs> yeah, you I might could. need to, but um, I don't remember the exact timing of this, but I want to oh, say it was, it was somewhere around five hours of gameplay. So if you do decide, like, if you're completionist and decide to do this, just leave your game on for yeah. like. Leave it plugged in. Yeah, yeah <laughs> plugged in definitely. Just leave it on for like five hours, and it, it takes about that long of a time. Which is so. St oh, I, I don't, I don't, I hate to bag on this game because it was a good handheld. Yeah. Game, but it, there's no point. I don't well, get well, like it. Like we said at the beginning, first of all, it's stupid that you're getting on him. Yes. Second, stupid, stupid that you're getting the mirror shield. And then, okay, he says it's going to take a while. Or whatever. You don't know actually, how long actually he that. doesn't even say it, does he? No. He just wants to chew on it for a while. But to make that five hours, I mean, I want to sit there and play this game, like actual gameplay, or left yeah. it on for five hours and figured that out. The only thing I can think of is if you drop that off and then you came here and spent one shell at a time trying yeah, to unlock it. Yeah, you may have yeah, we did that. We did dude, that's a gambling addiction, dude. I'm not lying. <laughs> <laughs> like, bad one shell at a time on this game, that's a gambling addiction. I mean, you may burn through a couple hours of gameplay well, doing that. You remember that one night we were kind of doing this together? That's yeah. Like, uh, the one night we were bent shells together. We were gambling. Yeah, we were gambling. gambling. Yes. <laughs> okay, there we go. But we were gambling, and uh, I think, like, we uh, we were bent, like, we had, like, less than 5% probability. Yep, it was Each awful. time. I hit, like, 4 in, like, 30 in. minutes, and, dude, I was, like, on a gambling high. We thought about flying to Vegas. I won't <laughs> Yeah. Like, I was like, man, if I could have just half of this luck in Vegas, but I mean, I was like, my yeah. god, this stuff can get a little bit addicting. So, the only thing I can think of is if you decide to, like, play this in-game stuff, maybe you don't have all your heart pieces. Maybe you gotta do uh -huh. the Kuko game. Maybe you gotta do the figurine quest. It's uh -huh. just like... Oh, we, are doing well, we are doing figurine well, we quest. Have, <laughs> we, we have to do it to get the car... Ca 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 Carlo, 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 Carlo Metal. Uh -huh. That's the name of the the, the guy, right? That, yeah, yeah, Carlo. Carlo. Okay, uh -huh. gotcha, gotcha. I, I can't remember. But like I so, said, like, these last <laughs> six aren't even available like, until after you beat the final boss, which obviously a lot of these are centered around the final boss. Yeah, because you get like, the different dark nuts. I believe yeah, the yeah, red, you do, the black, uh -huh. this, the white ones. We've well, not seen the black one until now because he only appears in Dark Hyrule yep. Castle. Now, I think the other ones had appeared earlier in the game. Well, Maybe. I think we've not been paying attention, but I think the first one is like Link and Zelda together. It was, it was, yeah. And then we have the Dark Knight right there. I don't remember what the second one was. We get the three phases of Vati. We, yeah, we, we get three phases of Vati to finish off, so I'm yeah. not sure exactly what the second Oh, the second one was the uh, Elder Minish, or the, oh, the Elder Ezlo. Ezlo yeah, as uh, a that's Minish. What, that's, that's right, what that's what the right. second one was. Glad you were paying attention. Uh -huh. No, I just remember because I watched the video earlier today, <laughs> prepare, but I won't lie, I was kind of skipping through this part. <laughs> we're just kind of, we're just kind of black. Uh, yeah, I did too. I did too. I'm not going to lie. I just kind of like watched the uh, figurines that we got. I mean, you've seen us do the figurines a little bit earlier in this walkthrough. It's just, you know how... We wanted to show how to get started, though. Like, yeah. I wanted to show you this, like, final right here because... See, it's, 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 it's a like... It's, well, that's, it's not the ones we missed because we couldn't get yet, but just... I kind of want to show you these last six, and, you know, the game's winding down. Sometimes you just want to... You don't want to end. <laughs> I guess you just don't want well, to end. after all the fusions and some of the side quests, oh I was kind of ready for this one to end. <laughs> I wonder how many people, like... I want to like hear from somebody like that completed this game without any walkthrough at all and completed oh, it 100%. It. Did all the fusions, did all the um, uh, the figurine, well the figurines yep. are hard to use gamble on them. But well, still though, to sit there and put the time in. And there's so many up, there's so many upgrades too. Like you had all the tiger scrolls. Yep. I would so. I would love to see someone who played this game all the way through and just got the Karlov medal and the Tingle yeah. medal. If you think, I mean, this did come out on a, on a portable uh, system, so I mean. It could, I mean, it was a great time to waste time on Good road trips. trips. You know, yep. I mean, I never played it on a handheld, but I mean, I, I didn't could, either at I the mean, time. Well, it came out very late, like that's true. You know, in our life cycle, college and high school. Yeah, we're not gonna be walking around the Game Boy Advance and. I don't know if it's college or not, but it's high school at least. Whenever the heck it was. I don't even remember to be honest with you. <laughs> God, this part is boring. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, we like to sell our videos high, but yes, it is. I mean, just. 
I mean, you beat the game. Like, you know, the we excitement, did. like, it's not gone, but, like, you don't want to come back and do this stuff. Yeah, we were actually riding pretty high. Nothing we've not been complaining, like, for the, you know, video. For the last 11 minutes <laughs> yeah. or whatever. Nine or whatever. It's no. in, whatever. But we were riding pretty high, yeah. though, after we beat the game. We were I know. excited. We were talking about the ending and how this game, you know, our feelings. It's like the hot girl you take the prom and then she walks off with some other guy. Oh. Now, that never happened to me, but. <laughs> worst I'm being serious about that, though. Worst feeling in the world. <laughs> <laughs> That didn't happen to you, did it? No. Oh, my God. I was going to feel bad if it happened to you. <laughs> no. I, was, I was just saying a joke. <laughs> I don't know a friend that it happened to, but we won't get oh, into that. Oh, that would but, stink, man. Oh, I felt bad for him. But we got the car last I was just kind of making, like, was it a metaphor, an analogy, yeah. or whatever it's called? It's an I was trying to make an one analogy. of those. It was a good one, I thought. <laughs> that was kind of funny. Thank God. I need some kind of humor in this part. Because, I mean, we got figurines and that's it. Although, yeah. Uh -huh. We are finally going to go back and talk to the big Goron. Yeah. Although it took a lot more time in between, like yeah. you said, so pretty much going to bed, leaving your system on. For a while. <laughs> that's that's a really good point, actually. That's almost what ex exactly it is. Just take a nice five-hour nap. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Who takes a five-hour nap though? Oh, I wish I could someday. <laughs> now you were talking about like in Majora's Mask, like the rock star one guy that we saw in that clip. Oh, oh I hate talking that about guy. that. Yes. Like, this guy talks about how, like, the, sh the steel is a uh -huh. delicacy to them. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm like, oh, is it better than Rock Sirloin? Yeah, that, that, that girl on Nia jump off that little six-foot cliff oh. in Majora's Mask. The biggest waste of time <laughs> in that whole game was getting that Rock Sirloin for that Goron. I at least kind of liked how this guy, uh, Big Goron here, is like, oh, I just took a little nibble. It's a different shape, but yeah. it's, it's the same Wipe shape. Wipe it off before you use, though. Oh, Wipe God. that thing off before you use, use it. Use some uh, 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 hand sanitizer. Yeah, that, they probably don't have that, like, really. <laughs> Available at Hyrule. But, anyways, that will wrap up our Minish Cap walkthrough.